active manager in ball, Pablo Moreira, and he makes three changes to the side that lost 4-0 to Charlotte last week. Nashville SC right there at the playoff line. A lot more patience within their game, playing the match higher up on the field. Than in Foxborough, Massachusetts, New England versus Nashville. Nashville will get things started dressed in the yellow, New England dressed in the navy blue. This is Nate Bucati alongside Devin Kerr. It's great to have you with us on Apple TV on MLS Season Pass. Lloyd carrying it forward, playing it through for Surridge. Surridge cuts it back across the six. Bumbery was lurking. Now Muil comes firing in, and his shot is denied by Ivacic. This is about the run by Surridge. Just watch him centrally off the back shoulder. They've gone 2v1 a little bit there, and he's asking for it immediately. He had the center back check back in and used the momentum against him. Very well done. Got to hit that with a little bit more pace. Bunbury, excellent run. But could they do it? With Callahan, it seems like that identity now is set and they're committed to it. Here comes the corner in for, for New England. Boateng on the backside. He's playing it back toward the far post and it's volleyed across and out for a goal kick. But there was a decent opportunity. I recognize the level of difficulty that this ball is, though. It's really well placed, but it's a right-sided center back who's calling for it. It's moving away from him on his left foot trying to contort his body. Seems to step from Moore, but Polster able to pounce on the loose ball. Gets it back to Boateng. And now Heel, driving forward. Longoni, the newcomer. Into the penalty area, Longoni has a go and just misses the top corner. Just really well done. Watch the outside to hold the defender and then the quick little step in. This is what I was talking about though, is patience. As much speed as he had and that explosive nature to get into the final third. Love him. Use of through ball here for Heel. He spins on it, flicks it through for Boateng, but it was covered nicely that time by Shaq Moore, who does concede the corner. Of Peyton Miller, which is where that overall movement started from on the far left side. Great touch there. Here's Heel just wide, and that almost was a carbon copy of the goal he scored in Nashville earlier this season with the left foot. DC all really in the mix for those final two spots in the Eastern Conference. Here's Mwil with a back heel to Surridge. Surridge denied by Ivacic. And it bounces out to Boateng. On this right-hand flank, they want Lovitz to come higher, but Surridge recognizes the space as Longoni doesn't drop himself to the outside to help defensively. That's where this comes from. Surridge drops in, the quick little one to him. Neither could Mukhtar, and it's cleared away. Well, that ball was teasing the Nashville attackers, but they couldn't find a way to put a shot on target, and that's going to force a yellow card tackle out of Shaq Moore on the other side. So Byron Terevich, who scored his first ever MLS goal in Nashville earlier this year, he could be a weapon off the bench. With this New England side, the big news is back from injury. We've got our booking here against New England as Mukhtar was taken down. And hand side more. Now Mukhtar checking his back shoulder, scooping it in for Bumbery, headed away by Arriaga, chested down by Mwil. Mwil with a second touch, shot was blocked by Arriaga. Better opportunities up top. Like more activity though. Mukhtar, long range. Ivicic sprawling to his right hand side, turns it behind for a corner. Inside the box all year. They were trying to make it two. And shocking the previous one from. Carlos Hill to do the honors here. Oh, and he found the head of Frioni, but he popped it up over the bar. He's got what to start with a win here today, but here come Nashville. This is Sam Surridge trying to put it across to Schaffelberg. It's turned right back to Surridge, driving it in again, headed away by Miller. Eric Terevich back to Miller. A touch. What a touch from the youngster Miller. Dangerous ball put behind by Zimmerman. This Nashville side, but still, we'll see how this final 13 minutes unfolds. Ball in. Headed away by Moore. Gets over to Moore. Moore. And that ball will stay in play. Lovitz does well to keep it in play. Lay all on the half volley blocked by Romney. To get him on the field that's been the hard part. 
battled injuries for much of his time with Nashville. Yusuf forward now, Longoni, he drives the ball in, and this header is perfectly tucked inside the far post. It's Brandon By, his first goal on the season, and it might have kept New England's season alive. Well, the words that we've been using over the past couple of matches have been about aggression. 10, 15 minutes to go, who's willing to go and chase it? And with Brandon By, just the inversion here. We've seen it a couple of times from Peyton Miller. Bye's been stuck defensively because of how much he's had on Sam Surridge, but being out for almost a year, his inclusion back into the squad just before League's Cup, gaining minutes, gaining momentum, confident. Just over halfway through the stoppage time. As I mentioned, Zimmerman staying up the park, and they're going to try to drive it forward to here. Surridge, Zimmerman gets on this ball. He plays it to Mukhtar. Mukhtar! What a save by Ivicic! Mukhtar again! This time, he slots it home, but it's waved off! Well, take it. Second ball was always going to be where it's at. Credit to Zimmerman. Could have been selfish and recognized where Mukhtar was. And the guess is that it has to be Schaffelberg and his involvement when Mukhtar hit. Again, just right there, that's the moment. He is in an offside position. It does affect them defensively. Wow, for just a moment, Nashville thought they'd salvaged a point. Now we're getting to the 94-minute mark. And there is the final whistle. The New England Revolution. On the header by that man, Brandon By, his first goal on the season.